Okay, so uh, I'm going to be talking about the full trailer for the upcoming movie Prey, which is a movie I've been very excited about. It's um, been a movie that's been on my list in terms of like streaming. It's right up there. I would say like if we were if not going with like full uh, like um, if we're going by like movies that aren't getting a theatrical release, this and Phil Tippett's Mad God that's going to be on Shutter are the two streaming movies I've been most excited about um, out of anything else. So, this is a awesome movie. This is an uh, this is going to be an awesome movie already. Now, before I go any further, you're probably wondering, well, why didn't you talk about this when it got leaked? I honestly was. I was actually going to do give my thoughts on it after the after the leak came out. The thing was is that I did I did see some videos start getting taken down by other people and I was like just to be safe I decided to wait for the official release to give my uh to give my thoughts on the on the matter. So, yes, I did see the leak. I know it was out there, but at the same time I was like I am going to play it smart and just not and just not do that and just wait it out. It's not like when other stuff, because I thought honestly it'd be released sooner, um, other than it, uh, other than it had. Like I thought after the leak, um, Disney would be like, ah, fuck it, and just release it, like how we got the sudden release of the first Halloween Kills trailer, which I do believe I think the trailer is coming out this month uh, for Halloween Ends, so that's gonna be fun. Anyway, so this trailer shows us more of the Predator, but again, it's more like kept in shadow and secret. And I was like, I really like that. I really like that we're going back to the roots. That this the Predator is like an unknown entity that you don't know what it is, and it's coming for you. I do like the little shield that the Predator has, like this automatic shield, and it's wearing like a skull, like a, it looked like it was wearing a deer skull on its head. And I was like, are they gonna like try to make this kind of like the Wendigo? Are they gonna like try to? reference the predator being like they're gonna call it like the wendigo which would make sense like a lot of the mythology around the wendigo does kind of you could easily fit into the predator like you could have the native american tribes like mistake it for the wendigo um <clears throat> but yeah for because uh, of a few things here and there i would not be shocked in this movie if they call it wendigo or something of that nature um I am still of the belief until I see like a full like something like in the movie or in a full trailer. Um, I am still in the belief that this is probably this might be a female predator. Now I've talked about this before. Um, the reason why I think they are going to go with a female predator, not because we have a female lead, but because well, not just because we have a female lead who I like. I've I've already like yeah, she looks good. she's going to be good. I like I like uh, the tra right from the full trailer. I was like, all right, you sold me, you're, you're going to be good. But <clears throat> the thing that makes me go, this is probably, this, I'm like, I, okay, I'm like, at, at most, I'm like 60, 70% sure it's a female predator. And the reason being is because, and I said this before in the teaser, in my thoughts on the teaser trailer, um, it's the only logical place you can go now. If you want to introduce another predator, then like, oh, autofocus, the only like logical thing you have to you have now is to go female like you've already introduced you know the other tribes and predators you've already introduced whatever the fuck that was in the predator and yeah now I, again if it's not a female predator and it is a male predator i'll be like all right cool what i like all right cool that's not gonna break the movie for me that's just been my train of thought this whole film is because a if you know your extended lore then if you know your extended predator lore then you know that the females are just as badass as the males it would make sense because we are doing like a female lead so it'd be kind of a nice like mirror of the two and b i mean c or three <laughs> I, I went stupid there for a second <coughs> um um it's the only it's the next logical step if you want to introduce a new predator have it be female so yeah I am looking forward to this. I actually, there's some really good shots in here. I really do like the one shot of the um, of two people running through the tall grass, and you just see the predator's like feet or like its body like separating, like something out of invis the Invisible Man or some shit. I was like, oh, that's a really cool shot. 
Um, we also get to see some fur traders, which I imagine that scene um, with the fur traders or or whatever they the uh, or whatever the hell they are, guys with gun, a uh, bunch of white dudes, or as I call them, cannon fodder, uh, are just going to be slaughtered in one big scene. I just know that's probably what that what we're probably looking at there. So, yeah, I th I'm very much looking forward to this. Again, will I be upset if it's like, oh, I, my theory was wrong on the Predator? Nope, I will just be like, I just want a good movie. I don't care if my theories are wrong. I don't care if, like, if, like, half my theories are wrong and I'm totally wrong about the movie. I just want the movie to be good. Like, at the end of the day, I think we all agree. That's what we all want, right? We just want the fucking movie to be good. Like... After The Predator, I was scared we were never going to get another Predator movie again. So the fact that we are getting another Predator movie um, is like, thank you, thank you. <laughs> it's the same thing of like, I'm scared we may never get it. Well, I do know they are like, Disney, one of the things after they acquired Fox was not just for X-Men and Fantastic Four, but two of the franchises they were most like looking to take from Fox was uh, Predator, or uh, excuse me, Alien and Planet of the Apes, two other major franchises I really love. So, hopefully they'll they'll think of something cool for Alien and Planet of the Apes at some point. I am very excited for this. I know it is going to be a streaming thing. So it is going to be streaming. I do acknowledge that. And yeah, there are some scenes in this trailer. Where I was like, oof. It definitely shows where the budget didn't go. <laughs> like the CGI bear, I was like, yeah, this is clearly a str got streaming budget written all over it. So, yeah. Or at, the ver or at the very least, it was supposed to get a theatrical release. And then Disney was like, uh, the Mickey came along and went, ha-ha, your show's going to be on Hulu, bitch! Ha-ha! Um, yeah. So... Yeah, I'm excited. Like I said, um, aside from Mad God, this is my most anticipated streaming movie um, out there. So, yeah. Anyway, you guys tell me in the comments below, um, what did you guys think of the first full trailer for Prey? Did you guys like it, hate it? Um, what do you think the Predator is going to be like? Um, do you think it's going to be female? Do you think it'll be male? Um, do you... Um, do you want also another question? Do you guys want to see more Predator movies set in different eras of time? Like, it wouldn't it be like like I'm kind of hoping maybe this will start a trend of like maybe having Predator films in different era, like one and done Predator films set in different periods of time. Like maybe one set in in like um, feudal era Japan fighting samurais, or a, how about a Predator story that's like a prequel to Predator Two. With like, and it was done in a comic. I I do know that, but sadly, the Dark Horse books are no longer in canon. So wouldn't it be kind of fun if like the um we had like a full movie with the, uh, talking about the story behind the pistol that Harrigan got at the end of Predator Two? Like, wouldn't that be kind of fun? Like as a full movie, Pirates of the Caribbean, but with a fucking Predator. <laughs> anyway. So once again, hope you all enjoyed this. Hit the link below. Head on over to my Patreon if you haven't already for exclusive content over there. Other than that, I am Mr. Multiverse. I'll see you next time in the Multiverse.